And let's just say Donald Trump can go ahead and pull out Wisconsin. Boom, that's it. 278, he is the next president of the United States. Now, that is assuming that he wins in Nevada. I want to show you one other scenario. Let's go ahead and assume that Kamala Harris, the Democrats, is able to keep the state of Nevada. Well, this would still give Donald Trump the win in this particular scenario right here at 272. So Nevada is not really that consequential. So the takeaway is this. In order for Kamala Harris to win and become the next president of the United States, she would have to win Wisconsin, Michigan, and Pennsylvania, and that would give her 276. As far as I see the state of this race, all Donald Trump has to do is win like he did back in 2016, but not even win that well. All he has to win is one of the so-called blue wall states, which of course is Wisconsin, Michigan, and Pennsylvania. He wins Pennsylvania, it's over with. He wins Wisconsin, it's over with. Same thing with Michigan. Let me know what you think about this.